hear a plane. Hmm. We must be near an airport, and yes, we are. We're on our way to Frankfurt Airport. We're on the Autobahn. Autobahn, sorry, my pronunciation. We have to catch a flight today. We're going to Vienna. I've never been to Vienna, so this is going to be a first for me. I'm really excited about it. I've been wanting to go for years and years, and uh, we're going for a long weekend. So in today's video, I'm going to show you the boarding. I'm going to show you uh, getting onto the plane, finding my gate. Then finally, when I get to Vienna, I'm going to show you how we get to our hotel. So if you're interested, then keep watching. Okay, just a little note. We're going to leave the car in a parking lot that is in the outskirts of Frankfurt Airport. So it's just a giant parking lot and you can leave your car here. They keep an eye on it. The fees are cheaper than if you had left your car at the airport. They have a shuttle service. Uh, they pick you up. You just have to call them ahead of time and they'll take you to the airport too. So Advantage, the price. It's cheaper. Disadvantage, you have to wait around for the shuttle van to come. We're waiting. Yeah. So I just got to the airport, took half an hour to get here on that shuttle thing. Um, the best deal is definitely the train. First thing, check where your flight is leaving from. Let's see what gate. Flight to Vienna leaving from A24. I have my boarding pass. I printed it out at home. If not, you could get it at the airport at one of these machines. So go to A. We're leaving from A24. So before you go to security, make sure you have your liquids and your electronic devices handy. I have my liquids in a Ziploc bag in my handbag and I have my computer in an outer pocket of my suitcase. So it's very easily accessible. At security. Okay, it's this way. Good, duty free. <laughs> Duty free car. Hmm. A24 to the left. Okay, so A24 this way. I didn't have to check in any bags this time because I only have carry on. You know, it's for a long weekend. You don't need a big bag for that, right? Okay, this is 24. Right there. We still have an hour though. Always make sure you check to see what gate you're leaving from. Check several times because sometimes they change the gate and then you end up having to run over to a different gate. So make sure you check that. So we're going to Vienna and the, it leaves at 11.50, Terminal 1, Gate A24 and then the flight number. Once on the plane, I select airplane mode and because I am outside of Spain, I always have cellular data off. Because this flight is so short, I was quite surprised to see that they were serving free drinks and giving out free half a sandwich. So it was a pleasant surprise. Out we go. Okay, so I just got to Vienna. The name of the airport is Wien Schwechat. I'll write it down so you guys know what I'm talking about. Now we have to figure out how to get to the hotel. There's several ways of getting there and uh, I'll show you all four. But I'm only taking one, of course. <laughs> there are shuttle services, lots of them behind me. Then you can take the airport train that goes directly into the city center. It takes like 15 minutes to get there and then you can take like the S-Bahn, which is the fast train, but it's gonna take about half an hour. Okay, taxi service, like everywhere in the world. Okay, right inside the airport, you have this desk here that says train tickets. So I'm gonna go there. Okay, so I got a ticket. This ticket is a one-way ticket. It was 440 and you can go as far as you want in the direction of Vienna, the city center. But you can't go in the opposite direction. You have to go in one direction, okay? This ticket covers uh, two zones. We are at the airport and to go into city center of Vienna, that would be, uh, we have to pass by two zones. If you are traveling within Vienna city center, it would only be 
2.20. All the different departures. Wien Mitte, that sounds like city center. The green stuff behind me, that's where you can get the city airport train and that one is 12 euros. Uh, it takes only about 15 minutes to get into the city center, so it's a first-class train. So now we're gonna take our little cheapo train. And if you have any questions, just go to the tourism office. The city airport train and the other train, the more economical one. So let's check to see what time our train leaves. So it departs at 13.47, train is S7, it's Floridsdorf, and it leaves from track 1DF. We're at Flughafen V, which is the airport, and we're going to take the 13.47 train, and it will be arriving at Wien Mitte, which is the city center at 1413. Okay, Floridsdorf, I think it's called, and it's train S7, goes to city center 1347, and we are at platform one. Platform one, and the section D to whatever, we're at F. We're in between E and F, so we're fine. Here's my phone again. Okay, airplane mode off, just in case somebody wants to call me, I can get that call. And cellular data is still off because I can only use uh, Wi-Fi to avoid roaming. So we just got to Wien Mitte. And now we have to take another train that will take us closer to our hotel. Now, because we're going in the same direction, you don't have to pay again to get on the other train that we're gonna take now, okay? We're gonna take the underground. We're taking the U4. Those names there are the final destinations, the last stop. See what direction you have to go in. All right, so we're gonna take the, we're, the line is U4 and we're only have to take two stops because our hotel is near here so this is the underground and we have to go track on the left <laughs> there's a train so we just got to Karl's Platz and now just follow the map and walk and just until you find your hotel. <laughs> Follow the map and you'll be fine. Welcome to Vienna! Okay, so I'm at the hotel, finally got here. So I hope this video was informative. I hope it helped you guys. And if not, I hope it, it entertained you at least a little bit. If you like to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to Mucho Hop. And um, I'll be posting some videos up on Vienna, I'm sure. So don't miss that. And uh, thanks for watching, Hoppers, and I'll see you real soon. Bye.